Hey, it's Randy T. Bird out here in Arizona, and I was uh, gonna do. I had my uh, New Heritage one month, and I wanted to do a walk around video, show you what I've done with it so far. Um, all right, starting out on this side, I've got new Vance and Hines uh, Eliminator 300s. Uh, I put on there. They are chrome. Uh, I couldn't get black ones for this model, but I'm thinking I'm probably going to uh, try and pick up a set of. Uh, chrome heat shields just to keep things in in uh consistent there or you never know i might have them powder coated i don't know or ceramic coated uh, there's a beautiful tank emblem that came out in 21 i really like it uh really is a cool thing of course it's a 114 as most of you know got my custom uh custom uh, uh, timer cover there on there the Willie G skull it was an aftermarket thing I can't even remember where I got them but uh, uh, it's pretty cool I uh, put on some of the uh, Harley Davidson um, LED turn signals with the ring on them which really looks cool uh, of course they work like uh, normal turn signals when you push the button magic as I call it it's pretty cool huh I like the looks of that there's a lot of things that I want to do but uh, we're still you know she's still new and there uh, here's the view from the windshield um, as you can see for 2022 they blacked out all of the uh, windshield brackets which makes it looks cool cool I think uh, I removed the uh, reflectors from the uh, fork legs when it was brand new so they came off real easy and uh, they don't make it look cheap I put uh, the Dominion grips on mine I've got uh, my bag in there that I've had on several bikes it's almost like a good luck charm my definitely good luck charm is the Willie G skull which I have taken off a previous bike and put on this one and I've also changed the tank uh, trim to one off a of slim which really cleans up the tank and and uh, the stock one kind of bows up and looks like an afterthought to me but these look really clean so you can get them out of the Harley catalog uh, parts catalog so if you're interested see a uh, Harley sundown or solo seat uh, extremely comfortable awesome awesome seat and uh, it fits uh, well with the stock uh, pillion or passenger seat got my luggage rack and uh, backrest that I had on the uh, street bob which I kept and so that's cool other than that I haven't done a whole lot to her so far as you can see there's the saddlebags and the, uh, the black license plate frame on there to keep in the theme but she's been great so far uh, I wish I got more miles on it than I have. It's been been awful busy, so it's been hard to do. But uh, more in the offing. Um, it just takes time, and haven't really decided what I'm gonna do. I do have a uh, mustache crash bar, but uh, I'm gonna wait till it cools off a little bit. My garage is uninhabitable through most of the day. Like even today, it is uh, really hot and humid out. And I'm at a little park down down the road from where I live, and uh, that's where I like to do the walk around videos. Uh, if you look up in the sky you see the big clouds building up so probably gonna get another storm tonight so anyway that's my one month modifications walk around for my 2022 heritage 114 this is randy t-bird out here in arizona thank you for watching thank you for subscribing if you haven't please do i sure appreciate it thanks we'll talk to you later